rebound. So, question I get all the time, should I get a practice pad with rebound or without rebound? Um, some of you may know I have my own practice pad. It's got a lot of rebound. Um, so you're not gonna have to put a gun to my head to get me to say rebound is, in my opinion, preferred. And the reason being is this instrument here is an instrument of rebound. So drums have rebound and the sticks and the body and the drums work in harmony utilizing the rebound. So practice pads that don't have rebound, are they effective? Yes. I mean, you could get a lot of wrist work out of it, right? You can, you can definitely strengthen your wrists, but you can do the same thing on a, on a practice pad with rebound. Um, the fix there is play with a heavier stick. I do it all the time. It just builds it up a little bit better. The rebound is part of how we utilize the natural mechanics of the drum. So I think people spend a lot of time doing all this gimmicky shit where you're like just banging on like pillows and stuff like that to, to strengthen yourself, but you don't need to do that. The object is to work less, right? You don't want to kill yourself when you play drums. You have this beautiful rebound and I can just, I can just play really, really easily by utilizing what's given to me. 